guess where we are? We're in the lounge bit, where the live band is at the Tabernacle. And that was Smokey Joe. And he's going to actually introduce himself and, and tell you what he does. <laughs> Me? I think I do everything. I'm a, I've been a DJ for about 50 years. Whoa. And uh, I produce music, mainly Caribbean music. And also, um, I have a mass band in Carnival. Okay, t- what's the mass band? What's the name? Uh, Smokey Joe Roadshow. Um, we have costumes that are made in Trinidad with, uh, by Big Mike of Legacy. But um, more to the point, um, that was something I drifted into, you know? Yeah, yeah. But I've mainly been a DJ all my life. Okay. You said the mass band at Trinidadian. You're Trinidadian? Yes, definitely. Born and, born and bred? Born and bred Trinidadian. Which part of Trinidad? Uh, between San Fernando. I was born in San Fernando, South Trinidad. But I actually, um, when I go back, I spend a lot of time in Port of Spain, Woodbrook. And you're here in West London, <laughs> London, yeah. And you've been here for X amount of years, as you've just said. Yeah. What is carnival? What does carnival mean to you? Can I just first of all ask you that? I know carnival is, um, for me, it's an expression of Caribbean culture. That's what we do. We are, we um, you know, after the wind rush when our family, my parents came from the Caribbean. We were invited to England, good old mother country, and um, they came here and they stayed in uh, they settled in the Labra Grove area. Mm-hmm. And out of all the adversities and the tribulations came Carnival. Mm-hmm. And I have been involved in Carnival for over 35 years yeah. now. But my parents grew up here. Um, as a kid in Trinidad, it's all about Carnival, yeah. you know? Plus education and other of things, course. but you know, we love our Carnival. Okay. So, but I got involved initially as a nightclub DJ um, mm-hmm. way back from about 1968. And I worked in the, um, the West End, playing mainly funk and soul. Yes, yes. And uh, then I drifted into playing some soca and calypso music in between. Yeah. And then uh, we moved into uh, the carnival part of it is where I play soca music on the road. And then I also did um, started producing soca and calypso music back in about 1979. So what happened was I ended up with probably one of the largest catalogs of soca music. We did things like Rocket by Merchant, Dollar Wine, which I released over here, which was signed to London Records. Um, and quite a few tunes follow the leader. So, you know, we built, developed, we had that. And also with me and my brother, we had a couple of record shops. Yeah, okay. So with total entertainment business. Yeah, I mean, definitely one would say, when we talk about carnival, everybody always says that they try to say about Brazil, but we know it's Trinidad that, that, holds, that holds the real king of our carnival. Well, I mean, the, the Notting Hill Carnival, unlike Trinidad Carnival, I think started off with the Trinidadian community and then it developed in 1973 a guy called Leslie Palmer of Trinidadian um, the center was in the area. He was in charge of the carnival committee and he invited the sound systems to come and take part. So while um, Notting Hill Carnival started off based on Trini culture, it's more about UK culture and Caribbean culture because the sound systems bought their crowd, right? So you have a whole mix in the middle of the carnival area, you have the sound systems and then on the route we have the DJs playing uh, with the mass band. So it's something for everybody. And of course, also incorporated people like Norman J and Rampage Sons and Winner Road Show. Wow. So really, while Notting Hill Carnival is based on, it started off based on Trinidad mm. culture, it's actually got a whole yeah. thing of its own. Of course it has, of course it has. We're standing in the um, live band unit here, of the lounge here. How long have you been DJing? Because you look like you're a regular DJ here at the, t- at the Tabernacle. Well, what happened is I, I actually like my jazz. And every Tuesday, they have Caribbean jazz here at the Tabernacle. So I said to Matthew a couple of months ago, you guys just start up at 8.30. Matthew runs this place, he's a drummer. So I said, let me come in and play some jazz funk and soul, which is what you hear in the background. Because the music I'm playing is something that I really love, but you don't get a chance to play it now. Everybody has me down as a soca DJ, soca presenter. So I'm actually using the opportunity to play the music that I love one of the sets of music that I love. I love all kinds of music. Excellent. But um, in terms of that, we do. I do this here on a Tuesday evening. Mm. I play from about 6 till 8.30 and then the band comes on. Right. And we've got some really excellent musicians. Yeah. But on a Wednesday, tomorrow now, okay. it, goes, it becomes a soca lounge. Oh, on a Wednesday, it's a soca? Yeah. 
and then we play between 6 and 10 just straight soca all new we review a lot of new stuff we got a couple of DJs passing through and we create and it's a family vibe as well one of the things is that is people can bring their kids down so you don't have to say if you want to have the kids down we had a couple of kiddies birthday parties things mm. like that so it's very family orientated this is brilliant this is brilliant what we need to do as we sign out now Smoky Joe give us all your social media um, details people can get in touch with you and know what you do um, I think it's my daughter runs everything I'm not the social media savvy person but I think it's Facebook Smoky Joe Music Music. That's all we need to know. Thank you so much, Maker Joe. I'll leave you to get back onto your very good jazz music playing. Okay. There you go. And we're going to come back here a bit later on because there's going to be a live band playing here. And it's all going to be very, very smoochy. That's going to be great. Smoochy, it's smoochy, intimate, smoky, intimate. smoky, yeah, yeah, smoky. <laughs> it's going to be very intimate. <laughs> very intimate. See you after the break. Yeah.